So we had some pretty strong winds last night. It's pretty gusty down here again today. Um, so thought I'd pop down to the plot and see if there's any wind damage. And also I need to get myself some salad for lunch. So let's have a wander down to the plot, see what damage is on the allotment on the way and grab ourselves some food. Well, here we are on the plot and looking around doesn't look too bad. You can see this is what we're doing with the shed. We've got all these fence panels, old fence panels here. And what we're doing is essentially we're fencing in the old shed because this wood isn't too bad. Um, so we're just going to fence around that and then re-skim re it. So let's just check out the blow away pony tunnel. And that looks pretty much intact today, which I was surprised at because it was pretty windy last night. So it's all still in one piece. Right, let's get a bit of this going. A few of those. This is lovely stuff and I should be going back and making a nice salad with all of this. I mean, oh, that is the best thing in the world. It really is. coming down here, getting some fresh produce, taking it straight home, having a nice salad with it. This is what allotment life is all about. What we might actually do is also, let's harvest for a bit of color, a few of these pak choy leaves as well. Uh, Maybe a little bit more of these mustards. Look at that. That'll be perfect for lunch. We'll grab a few radish as well. Job done. So let's get a few of these monster radish out. I mean, these are monsters and they're... Look at those. That'll do for me. For lunch and we'll harvest the rest how's everything else doing this bed so the onions looked a bit battered but they're doing all right there's some spinach in there looks like the turnips down the end here have got a fair bit of damage on them so i might have to come down later on and hook some slugs out of there over in the onion and garlic all the onions are coming out there's a bit of weeding to do in there and these are the garlics um now there was a bit of a mess up with this labeling this is chalk white and those say chalk white as well i've got a feeling these end ones are early white and let's have a quick nose underneath here to see what's going on and that's looking pretty healthy um a little bit of damage down in there that's not too bad. Everything else is looking pretty healthy, so we'll keep that cover on for the time being. And let's go and check out the 
the elephant garlic has started to um, do anything. The elephant garlic is in here and we put it in here with these honey berries and they just start to shoot through there and there should be two oh yeah just just about let's see it there and uh, just there it's just starting to shoot through so look at these um beetroot they're not doing a great deal at the moment um but we shall leave those in and what we want also do is grab a couple of carrots for lunch let's see how these are doing well that isn't bad at all let's find another let's find let's take this one out because it's in between two others a little bit of a tiddler um but that'll do us for now and there's a few more beans looks like there's a whole load of more beans to come off um but we'll perhaps come back down another time and do that and you know that's the plot we've cleared all the area over there starting to put in the wires for the loganberries and then the raspberries all the wood's gone and it's all looking wind damage free so that's a positive but for now we've got my carrots got my radish got my celery my uh, leaves let's go have some lunch <laughs>